Hi everybody, this is Gerdy at DareGreatlyCoaching.com and I've got a question for you. Are you familiar with the term or with the saying, Houston, we have a problem? That's how I felt when I briefly checked my email last Monday while I was driving back from a long weekend with friends in Germany. And um, I very quickly checked my email because a launch ha was happening on that Monday. I thought I had everything prepared for it. Everything was set to go. I had checked everything, or at least I thought I did. And then I checked my email. Then I saw an email which basically said, Gerdy, day one isn't working, which translated to me as um, Houston, we've got a problem. And what happened there was quite interesting to me because my usual, usual mode as operandi would have been to start beating myself up and to start talking to myself like, you know, I'm, I, you're probably familiar with this. Um, uh, you start saying things like, how could you be so stupid? How could I have been so stupid to forget to check X, Y, Z? How could I have been so dumb to let things start off without my being there, without me being on top of it? How could I be, you know, what a total screw up are you? Are you, you know, how, co how could you let this happen? And much more along those lines. It's not helpful. I would never talk like that to anybody else, truthfully, I wouldn't. So why do I talk like that to me? And that's not what happened on Monday, to my own amazement, really. What happened was I got myself to uh, a parking area and long live smartphones and uh, the internet and a good connection on a, uh, in a parking area along the German Autobahn. But, uh, I quickly solved the, solved the, 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 solved the problem, uh, I made sure the link was working, I made sure that everybody that is participating in the challenge got an email from me saying that I was terribly sorry but uh, something went wrong with the publication of the page that the link was going to, it had all been fixed and people could now go ahead with the challenge as planned. Like I said, to my own amazement, I was sort of kind to myself. I was, you know, I solved the problem. I did it quickly. I gracefully sent out an email as soon as I could, uh, remedying the mistake. And um, what was the worst that could happen? People would find out I'm human, you know, and well, perhaps some people would drop out of the, uh, out of the challenge, but uh, looking at the numbers, not many people have. So, you know, mistakes happen and I'm fallible, I'm human. Get with it, Ger, you know, that's just what happens. And I found that all the while that fish are jumping out of the water, I'll just show you where I am. See? And you can also, I don't know if you can see this, but uh, that's snow up there in the mountains. We've had a lot of rain and the temperature dropped a lot over the last a uh, couple of days, so there's snow up, I don't know, from up above, I would say 1800, 1900 meters. You can see a little bit of snow behind me as well, probably, although the light is not too good. Anyways, so I've been working on being kinder to myself, allowing myself to make mistakes without, you know, going into a rant against myself and calling myself stupid and dumb and whatever. And it's working. It's slow. I'm getting there. It's slowly getting better. I'm slowly, well, not even slowly anymore. I just did this uh, subconsciously. I didn't even think about um, not cussing myself out. I just didn't. So, um, my question to you is, are you giving yourself the breaks that you would give other people when you make a mistake? Are you giving yourself the break in life that you may have to give yourself when you come to the conclusion that you have been living the life of somebody else, living up to expectations, somebody else's expectations for a long time and you are starting to ask yourself, how could you have been so, I don't know, fill in the blank. Give yourself a break, be kind to yourself. You know, you can't change what is past, 
you uh, you did your best you you lived and you acted to the best of your abilities and to the best of your knowledge at least I'm assuming you did and if that is the case give yourself a break you deserve it that's it that's my message for today um, if you're ready to give yourself a break and want to start moving towards the life you want to be living why not join me in the uh, live your own masterclass that is starting on October 2nd and you can find a link to that in the comments below I'll put I'll post it there or uh, so that's it really let me know if you're giving yourself breaks if you whether or not you agree with me uh, that um, you know that is a much kinder way to treat yourself then um, you know just being so hard on yourself no need to do that all right that was it for today hope you have a good one as always go there greatly bye bye